Well, well, well. My father's been dating someone, and I don't know who. Do you know what this means? Not in the slightest. It means I have to find out who. Vlog style. An internship? Wait. What exactly is an internship? As you know, Adrian, the company is growing. We've decided to train a junior designer who can help with my and Natalie's workload. Based on the hat contest. But who? Mr. Pencheng, do you have the deliverables I asked you to bring? What color palette did you use? Please touch up your line work. Are you aware of the weight of velvet? It won't hang like that in real life. Please make changes before tomorrow. Mr. Penchen, can you take this to G for me? You shouldn't have been so harsh with her. Harsh? Was that harsh? I don't have to remind you how comparatively cutthroat the industry is. It's her second day. Again, the industry is harsher. You were competent from the day that I hired you. She's a child, Gabriel. I was a professional. She's not one of your senior designers. <coughs> you have to talk to her differently. <coughs> Natalie! <coughs> I'm fine. Natalie, it's getting better, I promised. I don't know how to change the way I talk. Would a little kindness make her a worse designer? Start with some encouragement. What's wrong? I never knew how hard it would be to be a designer. Oh, well, it's only your first few days, right? It should get easier. Yeah, you're probably right. Akuma alert! Akuma, alert! Ah, I just have to- Yes, let's- I need to- Goodbye! Oh! Mr. Guest, where is Miss Sankur? She was going to set me up with a company email today and, um... Miss Sankur is feeling under the weather. She will be back this afternoon. For now, you'll be with me. Ah, shit, 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 yes. Shit, shit. Mr. Penchen, I would like to apologize for my harsh assessment yesterday. It's okay. Has anyone ever talked to you about line weights and design work? No, sir. I'm self-taught. Well, when you look at a kit of drawing pencils, there are some numbers and letters assigned to them. The larger the number, H means the darker the pencil to be. Bold you can use them to vary the weight of your line. And this can make your drawings much clearer. I see. Hmm. OMG, Adrian Agrest, what are you doing here? Shh, what are you doing? What are you doing? And what does that paper say? Top secret investigation work. Spying. Yeah, I guess. But you have to swear not to tell anyone. Okay. Holy shit, I just got tackled by Adrian and Grass. Well, guess I'll die. Holy shit, I just got tackled by Adrian? Miss Sankar wants you to... It's not what it looks like! So in trade for a second surrogate card, you will design a line of fencing gear for Kagami to wear when she wins the next tournament? Who's to say Adrian won't be the victor? One eternity later. I'll send you concepts by next week, but no guarantee on the win. Fine.
Bianca? Are you okay? I heard you weren't feeling well this morning and I still need to set up my company email and Marinette. <laughs> Should I go get Mr. Grest? I'll be fine, but I need to make something very clear to you. What? If this happens again, you are not to tell Mr. Grest. Okay. <laughs> Come, let's get your email set up. Something is definitely wrong. Definitely. Gabriel, I got you a gift based on the year's trends. That's not my type of neckwear, thank you. <laughs> but you look so good in glitter, remember the old days? Well, if you ever want to model again, you know who to call. Look what I found. There's a blanket over her. I didn't put that there. Natalie, did you know Mr. Pigeon is on his 68th akumatization? Impressive. I should pay him another visit. Huh. I don't think that's wise, sir. Hmm? My father is visiting Mr. Pigeon. Bye, gotta go. This is a disaster! Can you believe it, Plague? My father is dating Mr. Pigeon! That would be bad for your feather allergy. Imagine if you had a pigeon sibling. Plague! <laughs> what a lovely day for pigeons! You're allergic to pigeons. Oops, I meant Mr. Pigeon. What a lovely day for Mr. Pigeon. Do you know Mr. Ramier, the pigeon guy? I have never met this man in my life. Phew. Thank Pog. Natalie, what the fuck was that about? I don't know, sir. Mr. Ramier. I failed again. At this rate, I feel like I'll never succeed. <sighs> I'd like you to hold this for me. It's too heavy to carry right now. See you Monday, Mr. Pencheng. Um... Actually, I wanted to ask. I'm having a video game tournament this evening for my dad's birthday with some friends. You see, he really likes the game and my mom will be there too, so it'll be safe. And what are you asking me? Well, I was wondering if Adrian could come too? She's a child, Gabriel. A little kindness make her a worse designer. You may go. <gasps> Thank you, father! So what game are you going to play? Oh, we're definitely doing Max's Battle Royale. It's actually really cool. What's your favorite character? Uh, Ladybug, of course. I can't believe it. He doesn't act weird around anyone except Natalie, but Father and Natalie are just really good friends. Marinette, Marinette is a really, is a good, really friend. good friend. Father, Father and, Natalie and Natalie are really good friends. Marinette, Marinette and, and I? But I like Ladybug. Ladybug. Wait. Hey, does anyone smell something burning? No? Because I think it's your brain, kid. Plague? Ow, stupid mannequin. Marinette, I need to tell you something. So, uh, what is it? So in one of my piano prank vlogs, Father said yes, dear, which I'd never heard him say before. I had to find out, you know? So I gathered evidence whenever I saw him with someone. Miss Surugi is all business, Audrey is too little business, he's never met Miss Bustier, and Mr. Pigeon was a fluke. Mr. Pigeon? Aren't you allergic? Listen, I'd rather not get into it. So, due to overwhelming evidence, I think Natalie and my father are in love with each other. Hmm. Well, they spend a lot of time together. And she's definitely keeping something secret, like me with Adrian. Oh, damn. I'd buy it. Wow, that's a lot. I have to admit, I've noticed them hiding things. Just to make sure though, and sorry to ask, but what about your mom? 
My life changed a lot, really fast, when mom died. It was hard at first, but I'm okay now. I've come to terms with the fact that I'll never see her again. I'm not sad anymore. I have more freedoms now. Natalie lets me go to school and have friends and do things mom never did. I would have never met you if not for her. <laughs> things are going in a more positive direction, but the last person holding on is my father. Oh. You know what we have to do now, right? What? Get them together. Totally. Say hey, it's Meg. This video is six months of work condensed into only 12 minutes, so make sure to comment and like if you enjoyed. It absolutely makes my day. Feel free to subscribe to get notified when season three comes out, but if you can't wait another six months, follow me on Instagram or Tumblr at MaybeMyEra to get chapter by chapter updates. And before you go, I've got some fan art I'd like to share. These were made during a thumbnail contest on my Instagram, and there were so many amazing entries, I'd like to highlight more. So without further ado, here's my honorable mentions. It's my job to protect the world from evildoers. You see, I'm an international super spy. I'll go anywhere around the globe and sneak in on Super Spy. Super Spy! Super Spy! Evil's met its match. I'll tell you why. I'm an international Super Spy!